Hi everybody, it's Marcia. I thought it was time that I'd give another update about, you know, my downsizing and what I'm doing. So today, what I'm doing is I'm kind of trying to map out the inside of my van and figure out where I'm going to put everything. You see, I have three doggies. And I'm going to have to take their crates because, well, I kind of have a quandary here because I need to be able to fit three dog crates, my bed, my things, and a refrigerator freezer in here. And, you know, among some smaller things. Now, I am going to take out the stow-and-go seats because under there is a lot of storage in this third row and the second row and I'm thinking about either removing that passenger seat in the front or putting it on a swivel so I can turn it around I'm not sure yet what I'm gonna do but anyway I have two crates that I can can fit right there like you see them now and then I have a larger crate that is going to go long ways right here. And I think that would leave me just enough room for my refrigerator freezer back here in this storage area once I remove these seats. So, but anyway, because once I get to where I'm going next winter, I don't plan on moving around a lot. You know, I plan on staying probably two weeks at a time, at least in each location. So, depending on where I am. So, once I'm, when I'm not driving, I'm not going to need the crates inside the van. I really feel more secure if I had them set up where I could put the kids in their crates while we're driving on the highway but then that leaves me the question of where do I sleep so I was thinking about putting a bed platform on this left side running up that way putting two crates on top of the platform and ratcheting them down to the hooks in the floor to make sure they were stable and then that one over there could stay on the floor. And then when we went to sleep at night, I could just fold that one up on the right and um, sleep there while we were in transit. But, heck, I don't know. I'm not sure. I've never done this before. Not like this. I've never went in my van and, you know, just trying to figure out where we're going to put me and three big doggies. But... I guess I'll figure it out somewhere. But anyway, that's what I'm working on today. And uh, I'm kind of happy because I'm making progress. I did sell a few little items and uh, some stuff on sale. You know, I showed you all this junk in my garage the other day. And uh, I did sell my chicken plucker today. So that's good news, you know. Anyway, that's all I'm doing today, so... It's Sunday. I didn't really do much today. It's a beautiful day. We had a bunch of snow here. I'm looking at my chickens in the backyard right now. But we had a whole bunch of snow. But it warmed up to 50 degrees and got sunny out today. And it melted all the snow. And, well, almost all the snow. And now I have kind of a muddy mess back here in my... Um, in my doggy yard. It's terrible. Watch this. Look at that. That's just kind of a mess there. I don't know what to... Anyway, we're working on it. We're getting stuff all cleaned up. And the kids want to play again. I was out here... <laughs> Look at Hunter. He's so silly. You're so silly, Hunter puppy. They want me to come and play again, but I won't come out and play in all that mud. Anyway, a little update for today. So, I guess I'm just going to go and do a couple more things and shoot, I don't know what. But anyway, thanks for watching and uh, I'll give you more updates. When I start figuring out better the better layout and 
where I'm going to get everything. I have to get the other crate out and make sure it's going to fit where I want to put it. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you're having a nice weekend. And uh, God bless. I'll see you on the next video. Bye now.